Hey there guys, it's McFly. Just a little message before we get into the video. Bethesda wanted me to tell you that there's a lot of spoilers for Season 5 in this video, so if you don't want to spoil yourself, make sure you click off now. You have been warned. There, Todd, I told him. Why do you have that pipe? No, I told him, what are you doing? Ah! Hey there Wastelander, it's McFly and thanks again for stopping by for another Fallout video. As I'm sure some of you know, the player test server opened back up and it's showcasing some of the Season 5 stuff along with the Steel Rain campaign and story quests. It's got quite a bit of info to unpack and it can't really all be done in one video. In this video I'm going to focus on what I consider one of the most interesting things coming to the Steel Rain update in Fallout 76. And without further delay, let's go! Wastelander, allow me to introduce you to Minerva, the new endgame vendor. Minerva, this is... What did you say your name was again? Scratch that, let's move on. But I have a feeling you two are going to be fast friends. She is a Blue Ridge Caravan merchant that will be arriving to Appalachia with the Steel Rain update. That'll also be the same time Season 5 starts, and it looks like it's aimed for late July 2021. She'll be arriving a couple days every week, ready to trade a selection of special item plans in exchange for your gold bullion. I'm gonna lay it down easy and just say they're not new plans, but some are from Daily Ops and some have a discount, so that's always nice. They also put a note here and it says, Minerva's no slouch when it comes to making sales. She wants your business and she's offering discounts on gold bullion plans so that you'll directly buy from her. Minerva's visits will last a few days at a time. From the schedule here, it looks like it's going to be a Monday to Wednesday kind of deal. But I guess being on a PTS, that may be subject to change. So we'll keep an ear open for that one. And when she does arrive weekly, she will arrive one of three places. That being for Atlas, the Foundation, or Crater. Super smart locations in my opinion, just considering it's free to travel there. That seems to be the bulk of the info in the patch notes. Let's uh, let's get some boots on the ground and let's check it out in the PTS. For this first Monday that she's showing up, she's actually outside of the foundation and you really can't miss her. If you were walking up to the front gates of foundation, she's right there to the right with a flag and a tent and all her bits and bobs. And like most traveling caravan traders, she has her own bodyguard. And to be honest, after a little poking around, I think he's my favorite part about this update. This is Tommy Tentos, formerly known as Tommy the Nose. Seriously, I cannot wait for you to meet this guy. He is pretty funny. Because this video is all about spoilers, I'm going to run the full conversation dialogue of Tommy Tentos and Minerva at the end of the video if you guys want to stick around and check that out. Tommy Tentos has a pretty funny backstory. I definitely recommend you listen to that one at least. Then with the trade prompt, we can look at Minerva's inventory. Looks like it's going to be one full page of items every week. Three of which I see are from Daily Ops. I see a couple in there from the Crater vendor. And then I also see the Vault 76 vendor. So you could probably expect an alternating mashup of that. The prices will go into more detail in a minute. But they also might be subject to change. Just because this is a PTS and it's still kind of early. The Daily Ops plans seem kind of expensive. I'm curious if they're going to stick with that. But at face value, I think this is a great addition to the game. This is what I like to call quality of life right here. For anybody else who's played uh, any of the Destiny games, I can't help but think of Zer in this situation. She isn't selling exotic things, but she is selling rare plants. It also just might be the weekly vendor thing. I guess that's what I'm connecting it to. Don't listen to me. This is definitely going to be interesting going forward. I feel like you're going to see a lot of people now hold off from buying actual full price gold bullion items. Or at least I am. That's how I see it. There's a lot of things I don't have from the gold bullion vendor, but from now on I'm just going to check in with Minerva. I'm also a huge fan that they also chose to cycle through daily ops rewards. I said it before, they may be a little pricey, and that may not stay like that, but if they do, I guess we'll have to live with it. Some of these are pretty rare, like I kind of agree with a Warglaive being 2000 gold bullion, but I'm not sure about a Symptomatic being 1500. But that's just me, that's my RNG, I got a lot of Symptomatics, and not a lot of Warglaives, so. And now with some hindsight, I kind of wish this vendor was already available like last season because it took me forever to find the Crusader Pistol plan. And I think I had put enough work in to where I could have just maybe picked it up from a vendor or, you know, the game could have just gave it to me. But I digress. Let's look at the discount. On the left, we have Minerva's inventory. And then on the right, we have regs from Vault 79. Specifically, we're looking at the Secret Service armor right here, but for the rest of the plans as well, it seems to be a 25% discount across the board. 
which is much appreciated. So yeah, essentially we're going to have a 25% discount on gold bullion plans every week from Monday to Wednesday. And then on top of that, you also have the opportunity to get a daily ops plan that you've been trying to grind for. If your RNG is terrible like mine, now there's a better way to get around it. We're just going to have to wait week by week until she sells what we need. Also, I could totally see them leaving the door open for like maybe one week when she stops by. It's a 50% thing. Like, you know how they've been doing like the script surplus and like the caps galore or whatever it's called. Blue caravan 50% extravaganza. Yeah, I don't know. Something like that. And finally, like most videos, I like to leave you all with a question. And this one's just going to be a little silly, but how much gold bullion do you think the Crusader pistol is going to be? I'm going to guess 2,000. But as always, thank you guys so much for watching. A like is always appreciated. Shout out to the fantastic channel members, Just Chad TV and Jorge Del Valle. Thank you guys so much for the support and keeping me awake with the cups of coffee. And on that note, I'm going to play the dialogues from Tommy Tentos and Minerva. So thank you for watching and enjoy. If you're looking to buy something, talk to Minerva. I'm just a hired muscle. Nobody's got to talk to me. Of course, you could talk to me. I love talking. Uh, you, uh, you want to talk to me? Yeah, to be clear, Tommy don't work for Minerva. Tommy works for the Blue Ridge Caravan Company. But seeing as I only ever get paired with Minerva, I guess it don't make much difference. Anyway, she's all right. Hey, you know that she draws them pictures of guns and stuff herself, right? And people are actually buying them? Maybe I should sell some drawings, too. I draw animals real good, like them kangaroos so, and uh, the rhinoceroses. And... I love rhinoceroses. You ever been to the zoo? I miss zoo. Yeah, I thought so. You look like the zoo type. <laughs> Got it right again, Tommy. Oh, well, you, you know, none too bad, none too good. A lot of walking, a bit of shooting, and mostly just uh, standing around trying to look all intimidating like. Well, they call me Tommy Ten Toes on account of my ten toes on the one foot. They used to call me Tommy the Nose. Pretty sure it's because I knows a lot. I knows about business. I knows about guns. I knows it all. Uh, but uh, after getting all ghouly, they stopped calling me the Nose. And maybe they don't think I knows it like I used to. But I got these toes, though, you know, more than I can count. <laughs> Wait, uh, 15. Fifteen toes. Oh, yeah, now you see, Tommy still knows. Oh, yeah, you want to see him? Oh, sorry. Minerva said I can't be taking my shoes off in front of customers no more. Especially after what happened in Chattanooga. That poor little doggy. Hey, anytime, pal. Another time, then. Okay. Minerva, at your service. Looking for some weaponry schematics? Maybe a pattern for a swanky new set of armor. My mind may be unending, but I can only draw so much before my wrist snaps in two. Not many treatments for carpal tunnel syndrome in the wasteland, you know? What else did you want to know? <laughs> You'd think with all the carnival barking I do, I wouldn't get this question much. But alas, here I go, answering it again.
My caravan sells recreations of all sorts of rare plans and recipes. At discounted prices, no less. I've got what you'd call a photographic memory. If I've seen it, I can picture it and draw it exactly so. The human copying machine, they say. But I suspect that name will lose its veneer once anyone that remembers copying machines has died off. If you're interested in plans at unbeatable prices, I'm the best that the Blue Ridge Caravan Company has. And what else could I be spending my talent on, pray tell? Turning a profit is all I know, and all I ever want to know. Sure am. Been with them since I was a pint-sized brainy brat. I'm originally from D.C. Survived the bombs thanks to my local library, seconding as a bomb shelter. Wound up wandering from group to group until my talents caught the eye of some Blue Ridge folks passing through. I ended up being an apprentice for a book salesman and rewriting books by hand. He was a dear friend and a great mentor. After he passed, I took over his caravan, switched from books to something a little more catered to the modern survivor's needs though. But Blue Ridge are my business partners and my family. I couldn't ask for a better one. Sure thing. So if you've got things, act fast. My stock is constantly rotating with new and exciting observations from my travels. But that also means you're unlikely to see the same thing on back-to-back -back visits, so grab what you can while I'm here. What else did you want to know? Tommy? Well, it wouldn't be a caravan without someone riding shotgun. He may seem intimidating, but he's a big, goofy teddy bear. Loves to chat, so say hi. Try and steal something, though, and he will rip your sternum out. I've seen him do it. Very graphic. Mm-hmm. But don't forget, I won't be...